This tutorial is going to demonstrate how you're going to create your Photo 365 uh, project assignments for each module. So to begin with, by now you should have downloaded um, or loaded your app, um, the Photo 365 app. So we're going to go ahead and begin by accessing it. And you'll see here that you have uh, what seems to be a calendar interface. And so for each day of the week, you're able to add a photo that represents um, that day. So maybe it's a picture of what you're working on for class or for your research. It could be silly pictures like I've got here of my pets, both Brady and Maggie Mae. Um, and it's a really simple, simple um, app to use, but it might be a neat way for you uh, to document some of the things that you're doing in this course. So to add a photo to the day of the week, you merely click on the date and you choose either take a photo, which will use the camera feature, as you can see down here on the bottom, to actually take a live photo, or you can choose from your album. I'm going to go into my camera roll and select the um, material that I've been working on for our course. And you can see here that it's been added to June 19th. And it's just a photo that I took um, today that I thought represented what I'd been working on for the day. Um, if I don't like it, I can merely click on edit and delete it and then choose another one. Now, at the end of each um, module week, the requirement is, is for you to actually um, create a page on your WordPress blog that includes a screen capture of what, you do, of what you've done. So, um, the easiest way to do that is to hold down the home key and the um, turning off your iPad key. And what it does is it takes a snapshot of your screen and places it within your photo, um, your camera roll on your iPad. So what you'll do next is actually go into your WordPress blog, log in. And then you're going to go into your blogs, into the dashboard. You're going to create a new page. And we'll title it M1 for Module 1, 25. Beneath it, in the um, blog page, you'll describe it. And you can just describe the photos that you use and what they meant to you. And then simply choose Add Media. And we will um, upload our files. Select the file. If we've got it on our camera roll, we'll be able to easily enter it. Add a title for M1. Photo 25. And then insert into your page. We take out allow trackbacks. You can add that uh, someone can comment on it. We choose publish. Okay, now we need to go into our appearance and our menus. And we need to actually add this to um, our module one area. So we're going to add to menu, place it underneath our assignment one. We save our menu. Now let's go check out our site. You can see here, having done it multiple times, there's um, 
the information listed here. Now at the top of your screen is the URL that is associated with this blog page that you've created. If you put, place your, your finger within the URL address area and choose Select All, Copy, you can then go into, and I'm just going to quickly switch to my other site, but you'll actually um, access um, the 5389 mobile technology, go into module one, go into the M1 photo 25 assignment, click in the common area, and you can put in your, your last name, and paste in the URL, and then you'll click on post your comment and you'll see that it'll appear here on the comment area. When I click on it, it jumps me directly to your assignment and I can see that you've completed it. And that in a nutshell is the photo 25. And again, you'll be doing 25 pictures throughout the semester. It's a five week semester. So you can see that it's been, you're limited. Um, but at the end of each module, you'll be including these um, screenshots of your photo uh, 25 project and then describing it within that blog page.